A new milestone today as Austin works to end youth homelessness by the end of this year. Today, LifeWorks opened its second affordable housing option for youth and young families experiencing homelessness. The Works 2 adds 29 units of housing. It's paid for by donations. This brings the total number of apartments with social services at LifeWorks to 74 units. Congressman Lloyd Doggett was there along with representatives from state and local housing departments. And we learned something startling today. In Travis County, three out of every four homeless youth ended up on the streets after aging out of state services, like foster care and the juvenile justice system. Cake Sansville Prazen takes a closer look at why. So permanent supportive housing, the program offers like case Franklin Fisher is a product of how family case, conflict uh, can like lead to homelessness. He never felt you know, safe or comfortable with his mother you know, and father, so he jumped from are. Nevada to Ohio is, to Kentucky guess, to Mississippi, kind of then to Texas, like living with relatives and like family like friends. Kind of like sleeping under bridges, sleeping on steps to uh, libraries and such. At 18, he had nowhere else to go and was homeless until he began a program at the nonprofit LifeWorks. He's come a long way. There was no stability at all. You know, I would literally see family members and, you know, people I knew from school walking by each day didn't say a thing, didn't look at me, you know, and it was a very traumatizing experience to feel like you're worthless, like less than human. The public safety net runs out when many become legal adults. You know, at the age of 18, they're on their own. They don't have a family support network. Many of them have not completed a high school or GED yet. And most of them are really suffering from some form of trauma. LifeWorks CEO Susan McDowell says 76% of homeless youngsters in Travis County left foster care or the juvenile justice system. Often it's not enough for youth or they need it longer term. And so that's where we can really come in. LifeWorks has 29 more beds, but more will be needed as Austin grows and homes become less affordable. The good news is, Franklin says the programs can work. What I can say is that it, I definitely feel like I've grown and become a person that I'm proud to be today. Phil Prazen, KXAN News. A big challenge, excuse me, for homeless youth is finding educational opportunities to get a job. There is a little known benefit for teenagers if they stay in foster care. The state of Texas waives tuition and fees for state colleges and universities.